Trying to find affordable housing in Music City is difficult, and if you're looking to get into public housing, well, there's a long wait list. Good evening, I'm Vicki Yates. And I'm Carrie Sharp. Nashville is definitely looking to improve their system. The transformation of Casey Homes near Shelby Avenue is part of that, adding 400 new apartments next year. But getting into a newer unit can be challenging. News Channel 5's Erin Cantrell introduces us to a grandmother who desperately needs a bigger home. The only thing to keep me going is my grandkids. Raising three grandchildren is rewarding, but it comes with challenges, especially because now one of her grandchildren is disabled. They added that ramp, but if he's not able to move, move, you know, into the chair and stuff, the ramp is not really helping us. This grandmother would rather stay anonymous, but wants to express how difficult life has been since her grandson was shot and is now paralyzed from the neck down. They live in Casey Homes, and while MDHA was able to move the family to the first floor to put a ramp, it's still tight quarters. She says there's not enough space for her grandson's equipment, and since the bedrooms are occupied with her grandkids, she sleeps on the couch. I've asked for a larger apartment, and they just can't seem to find one, and I feel like I should have been gotten a four-bedroom unit. And if you're waiting for one of those larger bedroom units, it's, it may take some time in order for us to be able to um, find one that is available. According to Jamie Berry, the director of communications for MDHA, they finished more than 500 new units at Casey. Over half of them have gone to Casey residents. Now, Barry doesn't know the specifics of this grandmother's situation, but says they follow the rules of HUD. And HUD will tell you how many people can be in a specific bedroom. Also, if your old building is next in line to be torn down, that's how MDHA decides who moves into a new unit. Right now we're at the process where we're having to move people from an old unit to an old unit here at Casey, and then they'll get to move into the next new development. This grandmother is going to keep the faith her new forever home will be here soon. It's been hard, but the Lord make it need to do it, so as long as I got strength, I'll do it. Reporting in East Nashville, Erin Kentrell, News Channel 5.